Welcome to Living Fuel TV. This is Casey Krejci bringing you another important health alert. Mammography has been the standard of care for breast cancer detection for now decades, but maybe not any longer. Occur according to a new study published in the American Journal of Rhinchiology, ultrasound was more sensitive than mammography. In fact, ultrasound came in with 95 plus percent sensitivity. This study was done on over 2,000 women aged 30 to 39, which is a low breast cancer group, but they all presented with breast cancer symptoms. And using the ultrasound technology, they found it to be far better than mammography. Now this is standard of care using ultrasound in Europe for a long time now. But in the U.S. it's been mammography from age 40 to a woman uh, for every year and until the old age. So a woman getting a mammography age 40 every year for 30 years gets a lifetime equivalent of about the same radiation dose of being one mile from Hiroshima when the bomb went off. Radiation is a lifetime load problem. So the mammography test carries its own dangers and is not as sensitive as it needs to be. So hopefully this will pan out that the U.S. medical system will start going to this benign, almost benign technology of ultrasound because most tests have a, a risk reward associated with them, many tests do. So a high radiation test, say a CT scan, would bring you a radiation dose equal to four to 500 chest x-rays in a single CT scan. So for instance, the information you get really needs to offset the risk that you took in taking so much radiation dose. The same thing for mammography. So hopefully ultrasound will rise as the new standard in breast cancer detection. And we've talked before in previous shows which you can look up, thermal scan is another good option. So the real trick though, the real test is that early detection really isn't the key here. The key is a lifestyle of prevention, which we teach often on these shows. I hope this was helpful to you. God bless you and have a great day.